Hey everybody, Tyler here with the wellness team. Going to talk about protein intake and making sure you're checking labels when it comes to protein serving sizes. So uh, I think a good place to start is with eggs. So, and you know, a lot of people think, oh, I had an egg or I had two eggs for breakfast and that was it. So yeah, the eggs are a good source of protein, but if you only had one or two eggs, you're having seven to 14 grams of protein, you know, total for your breakfast. So that's not exactly uh, enough. So most of us need, you know, 0.8 to 1.2 gram uh, per of protein per body weight. So if you only have 14 grams of protein for your breakfast, and then at lunch you had a ham sandwich, but you know one slice of ham is like four grams of protein, and then on your bread you probably had you know two to five grams per piece. So maybe we're at 25 now, and then maybe you had some almonds later in the day, which again good source but not a primary source of protein you're probably looking at another uh, five grams of protein so now you're up to 30 grams of protein and it's four o'clock in the afternoon and then for dinner you know you have half a chicken breast and maybe some rice maybe get you up to uh, that 50 60 gram mark well for most of us that is not nearly enough uh, especially if you're somebody that's exercising or you're active uh, you're going to need more protein. So uh, just kind of my takeaway here is make sure you're checking how much is in a serving size when it comes to your protein intake, uh, just like you should be doing for the rest of your macros, your micronutrients. And just looking at those labels and reassessing is, you know, am I getting enough of this nutrient? So in this case, protein. Uh, and if not, how do I need, what do I need to do to bring that total up?